My name is Hilary Hooks and I am the project manager for The Dancing Project. Why make our project accessible? The UN Convention on the Rights of Persons with Disabilities, the CRPD, states that access to information and communications, including information and communications technologies and systems, is a human right. The former European Disability Strategy stated that its objective was to progress towards ensuring that all persons with disabilities in Europe have equal opportunities, equal access to participate in society and economy. The new strategy, which is called the Union of Equality, Strategy for the Rights of Persons with Disabilities 2021-2030, advances that objective further and considers accessibility an enabler of rights. Why make the project accessible? It is the right thing to do. Currently, about 15% of the world's population lives with some form of disability. They should not be excluded. And finally, when things are accessible, they are better for everyone. How are we learning about making our project accessible? Online resources, including Microsoft Accessibility Supports, blog posts from people who have hosted accessible events, and looking at many accessibility strategies from different organisations that are published online. Accessibility Accessibility experts include an SLT, an OT, and an accessible technology consultant. We are incorporating feedback from people who have accessibility issues, including visual and mobility issues. We are learning all the time about how to make things more accessible and asking questions. How can we do this better? This is a project with many different aspects. We want to make all that we can accessible, including performances, presentations, emails, websites and social media documents and promotional materials. As an example of what we have done so far, I will tell you how I created our accessible website. I used WordPress to create the website, starting with an accessible template and added in a tool that can make the text easier to read in various ways for people who have a visual impairment. This tool, however, is only one step. We want the website to be easy for everyone to use. This includes people who cannot use the mouse, for people who have intellectual disabilities, for people who prefer sign language, and for people who are legally blind. The World Wide Web Consortium, W3C, has published Web Content Accessibility Guidelines to explain how to create inclusive websites, applications and content. There are three levels of conformance, A, AA and AAA, of which AA is the one that most government websites aim for. However, according to a report published in 2020, 98% of the home pages of the top million websites had automatically detectable accessibility errors. There is a great online tool, the WAVE, which can detect these errors. This is the evaluation report for the home page of our new website, ercdancing.minithuniversity.ie. The tool scans your site and in just a few seconds you will be told what accessibility errors and features you have on the site. I ran it for the fledgling front page of the site and then examined each one to see what the errors and alerts were and how to correct them. The two cannot do everything, but it is a good starting point. We are making accessible versions of our web pages and the documents that have links on it. Making audio recordings is quick and easy using the voice recorder on my phone. It has taken several weeks and emails to get the main web pages into Irish Sign Language. I experienced how difficult it is to find Irish Sign Language translators because they are so much in demand. And this has made me aware of the barriers that still exist in society for people who are deaf and the many necessary steps to fully implement the CRPD in this respect. Easy to read means that everybody can read and understand something, which makes a document accessible for people with intellectual disabilities. Easy to read documents use short, simple sentences that will communicate the most important messages you need to get across and pictures that help you understand the text. Doing easy to read translations has been an enlightening experience. Inclusion Europe have been kind enough to review our easy to read versions. Thank you for listening. If you have any suggestions for how to make our project even more accessible, we'd love to hear from you.